guys and welcome back to my channel. I'm doing another get ready with me because today's my birthday and I'm turning 20 and it's crazy and I feel old but not at all. Yeah. Anyways, pretty excited. Let's do my makeup because I haven't put anything on my face yet. It's 3 o'clock and it's time. It's time. And last time I did this setup you guys said you were okay with it. This is a little bit different. This is like a little further away which I hope it's okay. But let's get started with the makeup. Since I want my makeup to last, I'm going to be using Professional, and also I've broken out, and it's not even my skin's fault. I'll take full responsibility. I've been picking at my skin like crazy. I also have exams coming up, so I've been kind of stressed. I think my skin is kind of like, woman, what have you done? Right around my nose. I don't know about you guys, but I always, my makeup always wears off around my nose first, because I'm always like itching my nose or you know. And I'm also going to quickly prime my eyes using my NARS Pro Prime. I love this stuff and it's lasted me a really long time which is really good because it is expensive and good though. You don't need a lot, just a little bit. And even if you don't wear eyeshadow, sometimes I'll do this, especially if you have oily eyelids like I do because it helps your concealer to last. Is it weird that I do not like wearing makeup? Like. Sometimes thinking about having makeup on my skin gives me a little bit of anxiety. So I don't often wear a lot of makeup. Blackheads are the most satisfying things to pop. Am I right? That little white thing comes out and you're just like, yes! I'm so gross, but... I'm just using the Jack Black Moisture Therapy Lip Balm in Shea Butter with SPF 25. This is probably my favorite lip balm of all time. And as you can tell... I basically use all of this one. I actually think I put this in an empties video because it was it's bit there's nothing in it. Like I'm just like squeezing out um, the last of the product. So I definitely need to get a new one of those very soon. Cause I love it. Okay. So I'm going to do the usual CoverGirl and Maybelline. This is like my dream team combination of makeup because it looks natural. It sits comfortably on comfortably on my skin and it doesn't look artificial or like I have a mask on, which is ideal. So I'm just going to squirt like half a pump on the back of my hand and then just dot it on my face. And then I'm just going to take a flat top brush and just kind of blend it into my skin. The red patch is still doing its thing, if you know what I'm talking about. Um, it's still not gone and it's dry and it's annoying and I don't like it. And that's that. That's all I have to say about that. I'm just gonna blend this to make sure it doesn't look like I'm wearing again a mask. That's all for foundation and I will conceal my pimple with this hard candy glamouflage concealer and I have the shade ultra light which is really light. <laughs> Uh, but it almost is too light for me, so I have to be careful about it. Um, using it, and it's also, like, disgustingly pigmented. Like, you only need the tiniest amount, and it will cover anything. I think it's supposed to be modeled after the Kat Von D tattoo, blah, 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 blah. Do you know the one I'm talking about? The concealer? I don't even know what I'm going to wear today, first of all. My hair looks kind of like Shiza. Um, but, yeah... That too is life. That is life. Thinking like just a matte look using the Urban Decay Naked Palette, which I actually haven't used in a super long time, which is weird because I used to use it all the time. And I'm going to use a little flat brush and I'm just going to mix the two uh, matte colors in the palette, which is Naked and Buck. If you've been watching my channel, you know that I used to be pretty much obsessed with this, these two colors. And I'm literally just going to apply them into the outer area of my eye. Oh, I forgot to put concealer on. Okay. Cool, girl, cool. So that's kind of like all I want to do for eyes right now. And then I'll go back and highlight later because that's what all the cool people do, right? Look at my hair. Like, I literally look like a little child. I told someone in my work that I'm turning 20. They're like, what? You're not 12? I'm like, girl, I can drive. <laughs> Time to use some brow. The brow Maybelline brow drama. I've kind of come to realize it's maybe not the best product, but I'm still using it, so whatever. My mom posted 
a photo of me when I was young on Instagram and it actually like almost made me cry because she always like, do you have those people in your family or those people in your life that like when they speak to you sometimes it makes you just cry because they're so like kind and you just love them so much? That's me with my mom and my sister. Like literally anything they say to me I'll start crying. I'm like, I love you guys. Maybelline time. And we're going to conceal those dark circles because they're scaring even me. I feel like when I watch these videos back, I'm like, oh my gosh, Emily, you're so harsh with your skin. You're so, like, like not gentle at all. But, like, time, people. I don't have all the time in the world. To okay, now I'm going to take back to this brush and I'm just going to blend the rest of the concealer out. I'm back! My camera just... Just pooped itself it just was like whoa bye i know the feeling been there done that so i'm going to put mascara now and my normal combination is high impact by clinique on my top lashes and mac extended play waterproof on my bottom okay mascara is done now it is time to finish this makeup look for my birthday I'm going to take a, just like a matte, not matte, I guess it has like a sheen to it, cream color kind of, and I'm just going to put that in the inner part of my eye to brighten up the makeup a little bit. I'm just using my finger because I'm kind of a hot mess, but you know, in a beautiful way. Beautiful hot mess, a beautiful disaster. So now we can finish off my face makeup. Um, by applying blush and I'm going to use NARS Orgasm. This is in my NARS palette and I'm just going to apply this to my cheeks. The thing about me is I really like bacon. I don't know if you guys know this but I love bacon. Like I'm not even a huge pork person but if it's bacon, yes. Um, but bacon doesn't really like me and like I end up getting kind of sick every time I eat bacon but I still love it and I still eat it. You get head bacon today, and let's just say I've had some issues. Some pretty serious issues. I still haven't really found a use for NARS um, Laguna bronzer. It just seems too orange and muddy for my skin color. Maybe I need to one day become tan. That will never happen, but you know what? We can all pray. I'm going to highlight as normal with the Hourglass incandescent light. The one in the middle. I don't know why I'm holding it up here. Like Incandescent light? No. Down here. Yeah, right there. And my favorite highlighter. And my last year with me, I went overboard. But I still loved it. There's no really overboard with this product because it's so natural looking. I'm going to set it with the Radiant Light, which is just like a face powder. Similar to my skin color. I'm just going to put that uh, down my T-zone. I feel like if I were you guys, I would be complaining that all my makeup looks the same, but you guys are too nice and you don't, so thank you, I appreciate it. Because my makeup does always look the same, because I'm not even good at makeup and I'm not pretending I am. I ain't giving you advice on how to apply your makeup. Nope. I'm going to have in the past, but... I'm going to start with using Benetton by Benefit and just applying that on my lips. like this color. It's pretty. It's natural. It looks just like my lips but a little bit nicer. I love Max Cream Machine glasses. They're just like really nice pigmented but they don't have that sticky texture of a regular lip gloss so if you don't like that, which I don't. And this one today I'm going to use is called Richer Lusher. Kind of has a bit more of a corally look which will kind of go with the cheeks. All right. I'm all done and now I'm going to celebrate my birthday so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you all very very soon thank you for watching and thank you for wishing me a happy birthday on my social media I hope you guys have a great day and I will see you all soon bye drinking green tea gotta go pee now